at 9 o'clock, falling back to just 71 degrees. Clear skies here in the metro. And really, all day we've had mainly dry conditions all across eastern Nebraska and western Iowa with the sunshine. We've seen those readings climb into the lower 80s. 83 for Lincoln, 82 here in the metro. Low 80s through most of western Iowa, including Red Oak and Shenandoah, both coming in at 81 degrees. And a look at the radar sweep here. Again, there's not much going on at all. There's been one small shower off to the north and west of Madison County, northwest of Norfolk. Uh, that not really doing much. In fact, kind of dissipating here over the last several minutes. So uh, our chance for rain continues to be very low, at least through tonight and also through Monday. Uh, no real major storm systems affecting us immediately, but there is a large storm system that's brewing off to our west, kind of centered right over Nevada right now. You see the showers, kind of the south flow over portions of Utah, Arizona, the Four Corners region. This this entire storm system will move eastward through the next couple of days. It'll start to affect us, especially as we head toward Tuesday and Wednesday. Until that point, though, great weather. 82 degrees for Omaha. That's at Epley. Winds out of the south have been fairly light right now at 10 miles an hour. Look outside, too. Uh, it really is great. The beautiful sunshine here across the city. Folks are able to get out and about and really enjoy uh, this nice weather before fall really starts to set in. And we do have some changes on the horizon. Spoke with our weather watcher, first of all, though, Arlington, Nebraska, Larry Nelson, 81. Great day for him. And our almanac here in the metro area, temperatures above average and have been for a couple of days now. And we'll stay that way here through the next couple, at least one more day. 82 has been our high average right around 73. Uh, looking at our planner for this evening, moving forward, 9 o'clock at 71 degrees, still really pleasant. 66 at 11 o'clock with partly cloudy skies for tomorrow morning. Here's our storm predictor. There's actually a Front that stalled off to our north, right through southern portions of South Dakota into northwest Nebraska. So we keep the south wind. Maybe a few clouds for early tomorrow morning, but partly cloudy skies in the afternoon. So another warm day. And by Monday evening, here's that storm system moving from the west coast, getting a little bit closer, starting to take shape into the Nebraska Panhandle. That will slowly lift off to the north and east by Tuesday morning. You see, this is 6 a.m. Front still to our north. Rain though developing back to our west by Tuesday early morning, and then that's spreads eastward through the day on Tuesday, potentially lasting through Tuesday evening. Still a cold front back to our west, so again, Tuesday, 6 o'clock. That will head eastward, though. It's here by Wednesday night, and it will bring some much cooler temperatures along with us. 71 degrees, though, at 9 o'clock tonight. Still a great evening for you to get out and about. Set 58 for your low temperature and 59 at 8 a.m. tomorrow morning, but warming up again. Another uh, almost carbon copy of what we saw today. Uh, that's when changes start to arrive, though. Here in your forecast, temperatures start to get a little cooler, too. Tuesday into Wednesday, along with those rain chances. Cold front comes through Wednesday night. It does bring substantially cooler air for the end of the week and also next weekend. So, definitely feeling a little bit more like fall by Friday, Saturday, Sunday.